big news from Garmin this year at the Aircraft Electronics Association International Convention and Trade Show is a product called PlaneSync. And PlaneSync is a way to connect with the airplane remotely using a wireless transceiver that's mounted in the airplane. Useful for updating databases and checking fuel status and such. Let's go talk to Garmin's Jim Alpizer. Hi, my name is Jim Alpizer with Garmin. I'm here today at the AEA International Convention. Um, we're here today actually announcing a brand new product uh, called Garmin PlaneSync. This is a uh, product that offers a, a heightened level of connectivity to the aircraft. Um, so if you ever wanted a connected aircraft, if you ever needed some help getting some databases updated, if you ever wanted to get that data offloaded from your aircraft, this is going to be an excellent solution for you. It's just going to make life so much simpler. So let's dig in and take a closer look. Uh, Garmin PlaneSync is a new way to really connect your aircraft and yourself when you're away from your aircraft. Um, so leveraging our new GDL60 uh, LTE wireless transceiver, um, we're able to actually uh, allow you to uh, ping your aircraft from Garmin Pilot or even your Garmin Watch uh, to, to get status updates of what's going on with your aircraft. You can kind of check your fuel levels, you can check to see what the outside air temperature is, uh, see if the aircraft's been hangered or not. Um, it offers the ability to really stay connected with your aircraft, uh, both while you're in the air, but also while you're away from the aircraft even more importantly. One of the most important features of Garmin PlaneSync is the ability for database updates to be done wirelessly and completely away from the aircraft. No more hassling with data cards, no more uh, going to your computer to, to get everything programmed. It all is in, within the self-contained GDL60 in order to do your database updates. And it does it automatically. It'll do it uh, basically while you're away from the aircraft, probably while you're sleeping, and uh, grab all those databases from the Garmin servers, load them onto the GDL60 itself, and then the next time you come out to the aircraft to power on your aircraft, it'll quickly and automatically download those newest databases into its uh, memory and be able to transfer those for your next flight within the valid uh, date range. So the next great capability of Garmin PlaneSync is the ability to do remote aircraft status updates for your aircraft when you're away from the aircraft. So through a simple press of the button on Garmin Pilot, or even you can do the wake up from your Garmin watch, you'll actually be able to ping the aircraft and find out exactly what's going on with the current fuel level, with the uh, temperature, with the voltage levels of the battery with the location of where it's at on the airport itself and it's going to offer kind of that peace of mind to see exactly what's going on with your aircraft and uh, so you have peace of mind that uh, the airplane is ready for flight. So the next great element of plane sync is the ability to actually get easily get data off of the aircraft as well. So basically through Garmin Pilot, you're going to have your aircraft tab, you're going to have your engine indication information, as well as uh, logbook information. And Garmin, uh, in the uh, early part of 2024, is really going to add some incredible capabilities for aircraft logs as part of Garmin Pilot and your Fly Garmin experience. So automatically offloading your engine data so you can look at that, send it to a maintenance professional, let them know if you think there's something going on with the aircraft so they can kind of dig in deeper and have the right information easily and right at their fingertips. Again, no more managing of data cards or, or other elements. To, to get that information off the aircraft. So the main brain of PlaneSync is our GDL60. This is a LTE receiver with uh, Wi-Fi and Bluetooth capability. So effectively, this GDL60 can take the place of a Flightstream 510, allowing you the ability to do flight plan transfers in the cockpit, as, uh, as well as getting all that information back and forth, like ADSB weather and traffic to your mobile device. Um, in addition to the uh, data link receiver box, this GDL60, you have two antenna options, one of which is an internal antenna that can sit underneath the glare shield. That's that's going to be our GA60 antenna. Um, and for aircraft that, uh, that may want a, a better reception capability, uh, we do have an externally mounted aircraft antenna as well called the GA61A. GDL60 pricing will start at $39.95. That includes the internal antenna uh, plus installation. And then pricing for Garmin PlaneSync uh, will start at uh, $30 for the LTE uh, in North America and then $45 worldwide. We actually have it available today for the uh, uh, for select new integrated flight deck systems such as the uh, Piper M600 and uh, TBM 960. Uh, coming soon for aftermarket in the third quarter, we'll have compatibility with the GTN 650 and 750XI, our G500 and G600 TXI flight displays, uh, and it all networks together with like our GI275 indicator to really do a seamless experience for database updates and aircraft management of all those products, all those Garmin products together. Uh, keeping life really simple and easy for you. That's the name of the game.